everyone. Today we got a special ingredient all the way from Japan and these are known as Hotaru Ika. Also English name is Firefly Squid. So let us start the preparation. Now is the season for Hotaru Ika. Apparently they are only available during the springtime around uh, March uh, towards uh, end of May or sometimes even June. Um, they are beautiful creatures. Acor um, according to the documentary that I have seen, um, they actually will emit uh, bluish light uh, when they are caught. So if you are interested to know more about this beautiful squid, you can click on the link that I will share in my description below. And um, today we're going to cook uh, three types of dishes using this um, special ingredient. As they are not suitable for uh, eaten raw because they are parasite, so we shall um, we will not have sashimi uh, today. Uh, interestingly, is that uh, these squids, if you look at the size of my thumb, they are really really small. We're going to blanch the um, hotaru squid. Um, first, get the water boiling, and then uh, just a teaspoon of uh, salt. I have also prepared a bowl of uh, ice water. Um, we will not blanch the squid too long, just less than 30 seconds will do.
these are the three dishes that I have done using the Hotaro Ika. This is my first time trying the Hotaro Ika. Number one, I will try the Blanche uh, Hotaro Ika with that sumiso sauce that I had made earlier. The sumiso sauce really complements the hotaru ika very well. Hotaru ika itself is um, like a mixture of uh, egg yolk and liver. Not very um, much um, different from the usual squid that you eat. I would say it's very tasty. I, I like it. Mm. Next, I will try the aburi ika. So I'm going to eat as it is first. Smells really good. Mm. Mm. There's a sign of approval from Raven, my dog. Wow, it's very nice. Natural flavor. Without the sauce, I can taste the natural flavor of the hotaru ika. The last one is the one that um, I have uh, pan grilled with it with uh, some olive oil. Mm. It's also another different kind of taste. Um, for this one, is uh, I can smell the um, okay, I rather can taste um, like a cooked squid kind of taste. So it's very fascinating. Hmm. This is my first time tasting Hotarika and I kind of uh, like it because the taste is a bit like a liver and egg yolk uh, mix. It's something different from the usual squid that I've been eating. So I'm really looking forward to the next season. Meanwhile, I will try to research and learn how to cook uh, more dishes using this uh, uh, unique ingredient. So I hope that you like this uh, episode and I will see you again.